Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Today we're working on that CLK 320 guys. As you know, more than 100 videos coming on the channel for that vehicle. We'll show you where the amplifier is, the amp for the music on that thing. It's very, very inconvenient location. Stay with us guys, we're gonna show you. It's where the, where the hydraulic pump for the uh, soft top convertible is as well. So stay with us, let's go ahead, start on it. It's not easy, I promise that in the trunk and now we'll need to get a 10 millimeter okay and we'll need to remove a few bolts now those are the ones i'm talking about right here we need to remove all of this okay one is out we'll just collect it here second one This one doesn't want to come out. We'll come back to it. So we're going to get a wrench for these two because they're hard to get with a little impact. And also we will have the videos for the fuses for the convertible top, how to operate. coming soon guys check the playlist if it's not there yet it will be in the future okay we're going to remove that cap plastic cap that holds that carpet piece in place there so we can gain more room one on this side we already removed it right here you can see because there is more bolts now hidden bolts A couple more here, not as easy as you think. For instance, we have the BMW E46, that's the main build on our channel World Mechanics guys, and the hydraulic pump is way easier than that Mercedes. This one is a little bit complicated. Okay, this one, both of them will come out now. And then we have a couple more to do. Okay, we got this one. Okay, we remove that bolt and one like that on the other side so we can remove uh, you, we can remove that thing out of there so we can gain more room because there is a few hidden bolts. So now, if you twist it that way, okay, it's gonna come out. Same thing on this side. We need to unglue that carpet here. Okay, and we're going to install that one later, guys. So now, you can see we have more room. We'll actually remove those clips so this thing can drop. We'll be using one of those clip removers. You can get the whole kit, very inexpensive. We'll have the link on our website, guys. Okay, so you pull the middle part out and then the whole clip.
Okay. Well, this one is off. And we have more bolts, as you can see here. And there, you can see how many we have hidden bolts here. Very inconvenient guys, very inconvenient. Limited room. We need to pick all the bolts now that we just dropped in the trunk. Okay, let's see if that thing is gonna come out now. And you can see all the bolts inside the spare tar compartment here that we got. Okay, even a few more here and there. Tick tack, somebody left here. Alright, okay, guys, and we got the thing out of here now. Okay guys, and that's the amp right there. You can see we finally got to that thing. So it's time to disconnect it now and there is a fuse. Sometimes those go bad. So yeah, not very convenient location at all. Especially they tend to get wet if you leave the top down and moisture will get to them. So let's see now how we're going to disconnect that thing. So we need to press there and twist pull like that and this is the whole amp out of the car guys that's how you remove it you replace it guys uh, put everything back together in reverse order we took it apart it will be easier if you get it for that metal piece now with the four bolts so it stays in place that way uh, you you will be sure that's there otherwise you might not be able to pick it up with the bolts so thank you guys for watching please subscribe hopefully the video was helpful and see you next time